morning, the parents of a 19 year old boy who was killed in a hit and run crash are begging for the driver responsible to come forward. They say it happened along Highway 290 while their son was riding his motorcycle. Maria Aguilera joins us live from Houston Police Headquarters downtown with that family story. Maria. Yeah, this has been especially difficult for the family in many ways, and it has especially come as a shock for them because they say they had no idea their son was driving a motorcycle. And now after a month since that incident, police are still looking for the driver. Yeriel Rodriguez was 19 years old. On the night of August 31st, his life tragically came to an end. Police say he was riding a motorcycle along Highway 290 with his friends, weaving in and out of traffic, allegedly at high speed. As he was nearing the Fairbanks exit, police say Yeriel hit a car and was ejected from his bike. Then, after he stood up, police say he was hit by a white Jeep and that driver never stopped. Yeriel died at the scene. His parents say it was horrific because he was dragged at least 100 feet. They just learned he had a bike after his death and that he was keeping it at a friend's house. I just thought he was invincible that nothing would happen to him. The right thing is the right thing. And I'm just asking for the person to do the right thing, whoever it was. His parents say there's not a minute that goes by they don't think of Yeriel and that at this time they have no hate in their hearts. They just want the driver to come forward. Now, if you have any information about this incident, you're asked to call Houston police or Crime Stoppers. Yeriel's father says he is adding $15,000 to the Crime Stoppers $5,000 reward. Live in downtown Houston, Maria Aguilera, KHOU 11 News.